<laughs> Hi. <my part. laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Ah, how are you doing today, Sahar? I'm good, yes. I watched a TV series, as I said, as I was telling you before. I wanted to do something more, but I only watched the TV series. Only TV That's series? It. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I've been doing oh, webinars, you. webinars all day. And if I'm not doing webinars, I've been reading. That's good. Good for your yeah. brain. Yeah, I think it's making my eyes tired, though, because it's my what Kindle. Are you reading? Um, I'm reading some books that I really enjoyed when I was in high school. <laughs> I'm feeling, I love books. Yeah, I'm feeling a little nostalgic and reading some of my favorite books from high school. They're very fantasy, fantasy oh, books. Um, it's complicated because they're they're part of a very big series, which is like the Tortal series. <clears throat> but <clears throat> in the big series, there's four little series. Of course. If that makes sense. So each... Like the first four is about one girl. Then the next four is like a few years later about a different girl. Then a few years later, another four about a different girl. And then the last two are about the daughter of the first girl. Does so anyone like, else understand? It's about, it's like, you know, it progresses chronologically, but about different people in this city. And what do these different this people country? Do? They all have different things, but there's like magic and um, like fighting and knights and <laughs> it's good. <laughs> it's kind of like nice. Harry Potter. Oh, this, okay, okay, so that's nice. <laughs> it's nice. Yeah, that's all we'll say about it. <laughs> but that's what I'm reading. I'm on the eighth one. Oh, how many books are there? Twelve. 14, but I don't read the third set of four. I don't like those four. So I have two more after this one. Why? Is it, why? Don't you I just read don't them? like them as much. I don't like her story. Okay. Pasquale's back. Hi, Pasquale. Oh, hello. Salerno. And Valeria. Hello, teachers. I'm Valeria Hi. Rimini. In this period, I like. Careful, Valeria. I like to read and to draw. Or you can even say I like reading and drawing. So choose one. Oh, me too. I also want to draw, to start drawing. I drew a little bit today. I drew, um, where is it? I drew a pineapple. That is so nice. Is that for SpongeBob? Um, it was for phoning for a pizza. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. I also drew a shoe and a foot to talk oh, about to explain a heel. The... Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I did. That's also, so nice. <laughs> plural <laughs> S. <laughs> Those were my drawings today. But that's a nice drawing. I drew. They're okay. They're okay. <laughs> um, hi, Massimo. Welcome. Hello. Yeah, do we want to introduce ourselves and talk about what we've been doing? Mm -hmm. You want to start? Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, so my name is Sahar with the H in the middle and no A in the end. So yeah, it's not Sarah. Right, <laughs> I, here. right here, exactly. Oh, it's correct. Yeah, yeah. Okay, very good. Um, <laughs> I was born in the United States, but I'm originally Iranian. And as you can see from my face, but actually no, because I also look very Italian. So. <laughs> as you can see from my face. <laughs> you know, once a student told me that uh, Iranians have round faces. So that's how he understood I was Iranian. And I was like, okay. That's not nice. A lot of nice. people have round faces. <laughs> <laughs> All of them are from Iran. Okay. And I've lived in Italy for 15 years. And um, what else? Uh, at what the moment, do you like to do at home? Oh, at the moment, well, I'm reading. I'm knitting. 
guys want to see this i today i finished knitting this hat for myself even though i don't really know how to put it on yeah my computer's being slow i'm waiting for i want and to now, show the word to knit to but knit. it's not it's, no it's okay there, and there. i have to find another project to knit maybe i will knit something like what kendra is wearing a cardigan a cardigan yes but i need wow. the wool i've only <laughs> knitted in the past i've only or i've only knit 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 i think is it ed or is it just knit 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 okay i've only knit um <laughs> a scarf I, I don't know how to do a hat but i'd like to knit a hat it's so kind of difficult you need the circular ones I have those. Okay, well, good to know. Mm -hmm. Let's oh, see it's what knitted. It's, it's knitted. It is knitted. Oh no! Yeah. Actually, both of them are correct. Knit, 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 or knitted, knitted, knit, knitted, knitted. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Well, for everyone to know, to oh, knit. Oh, we have so many comments. Yeah. Will you use the two needles? I can go grab them. So, oh, that's fine. So, ooh, Alessandra, you want to read? Hello, my name is Alessandra. I come from Milan. I like watching TV and eating dessert. Oh, me too. Me too. What kind of dessert? Yeah, what kind of dessert, Alessandra? Pasquale said, in this sad period, <laughs> maybe, oh, ah. You're painting the windows and the I, doors to your house? That's nice. Yeah. But don't forget the verb to be, Pasquale. I am painting the window. Exactly and the door to my house. I'll put the correction in the comments. Massimo. Oh, Massimo's from Bologna and uh, he's happy to see us again. Hi. Yeah. So, yes, I remember Massimo. I think I had a lesson with you also yesterday. Yeah, he was in one of mine today. And Pasquale corrected himself actually before. I'm painting, good. Great. Nice. nice. And Marco, hi everybody, I'm Marco. I am from Bologna and I'm a student of my S. Great. Oh, okay. So are you from Bologna Mille or are you from um, the other? Bologna <laughs> Levante. The other. <laughs> the other. <laughs> Good. And let's see what Vale says. Hi, I'm Vale. I'm from Milan. In this period, I like playing the guitar. Nice. My brother is also, also loves playing the guitar. So I'm not very that sad that I'm not with him because if he, he plays the guitar like at least two hours a day, the same no, song. Like, enough. Exactly. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Quiet. <laughs> this is cute. Another Valeria says, Valeria, you have a beautiful name. How nice. And hello, welcome. Um, for me, though, guys, I'm Kendra. Oh, I forgot, yes. Here it is. I'm trying to, like... Hug it. Yeah, Not I don't know how to, how to do this. Here and here. Yes. <laughs> so this is Kendra. Kendra, anyways. Um, I'm from Seattle, and I have lived and worked in Bologna for almost two years with Sahar. And I'm 29 years old. And Never tell your real age, Kendra. I Never. always do. It's just a number. Um, and in this in this period, right now during this time, um, I'm reading a lot. I'm trying to do. Uh, I made a quiche uh, last night. You're trying to cook. I'm trying to cook more. Okay, I'm trying. I couldn't hear you. Mm -hmm. Sorry, maybe it's my connection. I'm trying to cook more, um, and I'm working a lot. <laughs> Very yeah. good. Yeah. Also, Saverio apparently is working Who? from home. Saverio. Okay, Saverio. Yeah. Hi, I'm Saverio. I'm from Milan. I work from home. Yep. I do something. <laughs> And Rafael says, Hi, uh, good evening, Sahar and Khendra. Yeah, careful with Sahar's name. It's spelled a little differently. Uh, S -H -A -R. I'm a little bit. H A R. Switch those. Don't yes, yes. Yeah. Don't be but sad. welcome, everyone. Welcome to our focus. Feel free to answer our question. Um, yay, more people are coming. We have someone from France tonight, Sahar. Oh, wow. I'm 
and tell me I'm Axel Erica. Can we call you Erica or, or Axel, Axel Erica? Axel Erica. Axel Erica. Oh, Axel Erica. Maybe we're even pronouncing it super wrong. Maybe. But she's from France. That's really nice. Yeah. And what do you like? Oh, what do you like to do? Yeah, what do you like to do at home in this now. period? Yeah, maybe in France it's not so do they strict. Have to quarantine now? I don't know. Yeah, Axel Erica, are you in quarantine in France like we are in in Italy? <laughs> we have one other one. Ooh, this mm. is a long one. Your turn, Sahar. Good evening, everybody. <laughs> my, my name is Eulalia. I live, I live, uh, no, I am in the suburbs of Rome, Italy. But I came from Mozambique. In this period, I like cooking and experimenting with, experimenting, no, with new recipes because I have a lot of time. Wonderful. Good. Hey, careful with I came from mm -hmm. because that tells me it's almost like like you're dead. Yeah. <laughs> we That's only say came true. from. Yeah, we only say came from when someone has died. Their life yeah, is. For example, finished. Shakespeare came from England. Shakespeare died a long time ago. Mm -hmm. But I did not. I did not come from Seattle. I come from. How, how do I say this? I wouldn't say I came from Seattle. That means I came in. Dead. I came, in. I came I, in from Seattle. I come from Seattle. <clears throat> it's still true now because I'm alive. I'm living. <laughs> Good. And uh -huh. Rafael says, I'm Rafael. I'm 35 years old. I live in Salerno in this period. I study English language every day. Perfect, Rafael. That's very good. Awesome. Rafael, I also want to learn another language in this you period. Do. What do but, you then, learn? but then I started watching TV. <laughs> Arabic. Then what's this one? Arabic. You want to learn Arabic? Arabic. Okay. Uh, at the end of this quarantine, I will not learn Arabic because I know myself. I found <laughs> these new series. I can't stop. I like to indulge in it. I'm the same. If I start a TV <laughs> series, I can't stop. I must finish. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yes. Oh, Axel is in uh, quarantine. I'm a student, but now my university is closed. Uh, closed. Mm -hmm. So I'm working at home. So you also have lectures uh, through Skype, maybe through the internet. Mm -mm. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. maybe. I don't know. I'm wondering if um, StreamYard is having problems or if I'm having problems. You're not having problems. We can see you. Okay. I can see you. When I'm making comments, it's not going very fast. Yeah. Anyways, guys, let's take a look at our focus for today. Ta -da. Education. Education. So what do we got, Sahar? We'll be seeing simple past, past school experiences, there was and there were. So buckle up. We're doing the past today. <laughs> buckle up. <laughs> we're doing the past. Okay. <clears throat> so we have some questions for you all to answer in the comments. The first, did you like going to school when you were a child? Oh, it's me. <laughs> it's like, it's, um, so... It depends when, because I don't remember elementary school. I hated middle, middle school. I enjoyed high school. Yeah, high school was okay. 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 You don't yeah, what about you? Elementary. Um, I liked going to school when I was a child. When I was a child, yes, I liked elementary school. Um, but, but I had... I had some years that were better. Like I really like I really liked my fifth grade teacher. Mm -hmm. And she, she was, was the favorite. teacher of which subject? 
my fifth in the united states it's different the teacher you have is for the whole year and all subjects okay then the next year you change the students change because normally there might be for example three fifth grade classes uh-huh so then all the students change and then you're put with a sixth grade teacher oh okay so, so you always got mixed up Mm -hmm. And teachers teach a grade, not a subject. Oh, so they teach all the subjects. Yeah, they teach all the subjects, but to an age group. Wow. Yeah. And sometimes teachers will switch grades. Mm -hmm. Also, that is so complicated. Why not have more job opportunities and have multiple teachers? Well, I mean, we do have multiple teachers but they the way the university is you study um for elementary education you're studying to teach all of the elementary so okay levels. you study more psychology and, and psychology, how about high school? Also, high school you how about high school high school is um each teacher teaches a different no, subject no, but for you for you i liked high school mm -hmm. i liked high school a lot um yeah my school was good i preferred oh, university oh yeah 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 i think I, mean, i think so too also pasquale liked going to school remember guys when. past simple today yeah very good when though when i was a child no i only didn't like middle school i really hated middle school i didn't I, like middle school so a lot of either. bullies at that time Mm -hmm. yeah yeah i agree anyway where was your school um again it depends on what school when i went to elementary um i went to two different schools so my first elementary school was in georgia and then i moved to washington to seattle So that one was different. And then my middle school was in Kent, Washington, and my high school was in Auburn, Washington. Oh my God, yeah. you changed a lot. I changed, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at all these comments we're having, we're receiving. So Valeria, I liked, liked. So we're using the past, today let's just use the past. I liked going to school when I was a child because I stayed in the classroom with my friends but I hated math lessons. Yeah, I you just, you can't even say I hated math or just math. Yeah, I like, hated math. Math yeah. for British, math for American. Um, <laughs> Massimo said, I went to school in my neighborhood, but I didn't like it very much. Okay. But why Fair didn't enough. you like it? What was yeah. it that you didn't enjoy? What didn't you enjoy, Massimo? Mm -hmm. About this one. Again, when I was a child, I liked going. Well, but no, Rafael uh, corrected himself. Very good, very good. Like going to elementary school. I think, I know, I must say like the kindergarten period was my favorite period because we could go to sleep. And we could take naps. We could exactly. take naps. Yeah. Maybe a new word for everyone. A nap is like a a short a little little sleep it's a siesta <laughs> yeah yeah mm -hmm. in elementary in kindergarten we took naps mm -hmm. yeah yeah and uh, ba -ba -ba. where is it? oh we and have Vale also again yeah Vale said when i was a child i liked going to school good the elementary school was in my, in your country, in Italy? Maybe yeah, she means Italy. town. Maybe town. Because they say a lot in paese, in your yep. paese, referring to towns or villages. So yeah. maybe she means that. Yeah, for us, country would be Italy, Italy France, the United States. Um, so if it's a small city, we would say town. Ba -ba -ba. Some examples of country. 
it's so slow today. Um, but a town. So Pasquale liked it because it was 15 minutes away from her, his house. Yeah. Okay. We can yeah. take out the car. The school was 15 minutes from my house. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Hello, Salvatore. Welcome. Welcome. Oh, Alessandra, I liked going to school if I wasn't questioned by the teacher. I wasn't, no, not questioned, maybe. Um, tested? Yeah, tested. I was going to say examined, but that's also very correct. <laughs> uh, yeah, tested by the teacher. Because uh, question, to question someone is, for example, what a detective does. Yeah. You question where, where, where were you last night? <laughs> <laughs> to be like questioned. Uh, Sherlock Holmes. Yeah, like Sherlock Holmes, exactly. So then, Sahar, what didn't you like about school? Are you going to ask me where, where, where my school was? Where was your school, Sahar? I'm sorry. Rude. <laughs> um, in, I was both uh, for the elementary and the middle school in Iran. And then mm -hmm. I moved to Italy for high school. That's it. <laughs> yeah. So we have another one that popped up. When in my country, I liked going to school. Good. Maybe when I was in my country, I liked mm -hmm. going to school. But wonderful. Okay. Yeah. Not in not in Italy. Not in the country oh, no, right no. now. It was the opposite. I hated the school in Iran. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Okay. No, I liked. I think I liked all my schools. Well, because you're probably the popular girl. No, I was not. No? No, I was not. I was not one of the popular kids. So what I were wasn't, you? I was like in the middle. I was just like, oh, not. I think so too. Yeah, I was like in the middle, floating, yeah. just doing my stuff. <laughs> like I had my friends, like people maybe kind of knew who I was, but I wasn't. I wasn't like a, a loser or a nerd, um, mm -hmm. but I wasn't like the popular girl. In the middle. Yeah. Let's I wonder who in our school is the popular girl. Like, no, like as in, as in when they were a child. Oh, okay. I was like, what? <laughs> that is a good question. I wonder. I don't know if anyone is yeah. or was. Guys, were you popular when you went to school? Yeah. I'm going to ask you. Popular. Oh, Pasquale says, when I went to school, I passed, didn't like waking up in the morning. Uh, yeah, yeah, be careful. Because I didn't like, didn't, don't, passed, didn't. And no, then I, again. Oh, I clicked Marcos before Rafael's. My <laughs> elementary school was near my house. Wonderful. I love when it's near your house. Exactly. My elementary school in Washington, in Kent, Seattle, was near my house. I would walk to school. You walked to school? I walked to school. Mm -hmm. I rode my bike to school. Mm -hmm. I liked especially high school. I liked high school especially. Or I especially liked high school. Yes. <laughs> I especially liked high school. When I went to elementary, I didn't remember a lot. Yeah. So you don't remember much of elementary, maybe, because mm -hmm. I don't remember now in the present. But, Valeria said I was the opposite of popular. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. And Massimo, I... Oh. Hey, okay, no. Massimo said, I did like only gym. I only liked them. Liked. Gym and science. Science. Lessons. Nobody oh, else. Nothing else. Oh, nothing else. Okay, that's what he meant. Mm -hmm. Nothing else. Be careful, Massimo. We use did when uh, in the past we are talking about a negative or a question. A question. So like I, you could say I didn't like the gym or you can ask a question, did you like the gym? But if it's a positive sentence, 
you can use the verb I liked. Yeah, just the regular past simple of the verb. And I'm curious about this. I was turbulent. <laughs> what does that mean? I was turbulent. I think I know what he means. What do you think he means? Like, um, you know, how boys are. Like a troublemaker. Exactly. Okay. Or um, naughty. Naughty. <laughs> I would just say troublemaker. Okay, we'll put them both up there. Yeah, turbulent um, is what I think more of if there's like a plane a yeah. and there's turbulence. Mm -hmm. So for a person, maybe no, I would it, say a troublemaker. I think it's a direct translation from Italian because Probably. they have tormento. Yes, mm -hmm. that's what he meant, troublemaker. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Salvatore says, I didn't like math. I like Did math. you like math? I was good at math. Me too. I studied math at university for like the first three years. What? Yeah. Like math, math as in mathematics? Math. Yes. Your course degree was mathematics? For the first three years. And then Are I changed. No. So for everyone watching, can I, I take like, some time? Like, she, Sahar needs to think. When I went to university, um, I started studying math. And after three years, I decided I don't like this. And I switched to art history. So most of the teachers at school, like Sahar, they don't know Who is in that I studied math, only art history. So this is surprising for a lot of people that I studied math. Um, and why did you stop? I did not understand math theory. But in practice, yeah. Yeah, in practice it was fine. But in like studying theory, which was like my entire last year of university, I didn't understand, I didn't like it. I was starting to not do well in my classes. So mm -hmm. I, it was done for me at that it's point. Like such a shocker to me. I, I couldn't see you like, not that you're math. not good. I wanted to be a math good. teacher. Really? Oh my God. That is so sweet. I changed. <laughs> you still became a teacher. I'm still a teacher. Yeah. Teaching is in my blood. Uh, Marcello, hello, nice to meet you too. And he said, I liked going to my school, not in, to my school when I was a child. Mm -hmm. Good. And Frank said, I was not popular, but introverted. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I, I was a little also, introverted. Yes. I stopped in high school in high school suddenly there was a change i became an um, extrovert i was like yay friendly and fun yay, friendly friendly fun sahar i was more i was maybe i was just shy mm. i didn't know someone i was very shy but if i knew like my friends i was more extroverted with my friends yeah and Which what didn't you normal. like about school um, <clears throat> let's think. I didn't like, 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 bullying. Um, I, for most Did of um, elementary, hmm? let me repeat, I, I didn't, didn't like bullies. Bullies? Yeah. Yeah. Because, not that, I was bullied a lot. Um, I'm going to write bullies, plural, for everyone. Um, and maybe bully is a new word. A bully, everyone, is a person who is, like, mean to someone else, who says mean things. Maybe they push them. They hurt them. Yeah, I'm I'm, I think it's a adopted word that other languages also use. use yeah Probably. but more my i think so in elementary i did gymnastics um think of like uh simone 
Biles or um, who's another famous uh, gymnast right now? I don't remember. Usain Bolt? No, gymnast. Oh, gymnast, okay. You, Not you runner. <laughs> gymnast, no, no. Like Simone Biles or oh, I'm trying to think. Gymnast. A gymnast, anyways. Um, so when I stopped doing gymnastics, it was very strange for me because gymnastics was my life. That's where if I wasn't at school, I was at gymnastics. Um, mm -hmm. So then, oh, oh, I loved gymnastics, but I eventually stopped. I stopped mm -hmm. doing it. Um, club gymnastics, private, okay. no, not important. But at that time when I stopped, I had to kind of figure out who I was not with yeah. gymnastics. And so um, sometimes my friends would kind of tease me or they saw me as annoying in my uh, behavior because I was understanding who I was. Um, so things were kids. better in high school. Yeah. Kids. Kids. Uh, when I went to school, I didn't like when there was the art lesson. Ooh. Why not? I loved art less. Oh no, wait. I loved art lesson in high school. I hated it in elementary school. Cause my teacher was crazy, I swear. She was out of her mind. I remember it's that in elementary school. <laughs> also, Rafael like, didn't like, like history. Oh no, Rafael. Uh uh. Mm -mm. That's, That's the hardest subject. This is like Raffaele didn't like your subject and Marcello didn't <laughs> like my subject. Exactly. No, why don't you like history, Raffaele? It's so beautiful. It's so amazing. So don't, get, don't get so hard started. Okay, <laughs> let's move on. <laughs> let's see. This is a book that I'm reading. Well, it's about the present, actually, but the same writer wrote a book about the whole history of humankind. And it's really nice. If you read that, yeah, if you read that, you will love history as much as I do. You will marry history. Maybe. <laughs> Everyone has different tastes. It's okay. Um, so Unacceptable. He thought it was boring. Unacceptable. <laughs> uh, Frank didn't like literature. Actually, yes. I didn't like literature either. I didn't like English literature. Yeah, I didn't either. It was, it was so, not my favorite. I don't know. Like, I feel as though the Italian language has much more to offer than the English language. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Um, well, guys, let's do some matching here. Uh, we have levels of school, kindergarten. Oh, she, she doesn't like geography. Someone else doesn't like geography. Okay. Yeah, me either. There were certain subjects I just didn't like. Um, but what else? We have kindergarten, elementary school, middle school, high school, and university. So use the letters A, B, C, D, E, and tell us in the comments. And I think, so for me in the United States, kindergarten is a part of elementary. Really? Yeah. We have preschool. Oh, yeah. Kindergarten is preschool, isn't it? Not for me. Not for United States. I kindergarten is there. Yeah, because I remember, mm -hmm. I remember going to kindergarten here in Italy, which was different from middle school. It's asilo. Oh, so many answers. One sec. Yeah, so well, let's, let's begin with A, though. <laughs> yeah. A, I'm seeing middle school mm -hmm. and middle school. So let's see. A, middle school. Great middle job, school. guys. Yes, yes. B, B, someone said kindergarten. Yeah. Um, someone said elementary. Also, said kindergarten. Assemblea. Is that the is that the name? I forgot. What? Her the her name. Um Assemblea. 
It is because I have a hard time remembering too. <laughs> no, Ulelia. Ulelia, sorry, Ulelia. And yes, the correct one is anyway, uh, kindergarten. Kindergarten. Yeah. I see high school. Massimo high says school. high school. Rafael says high school. Pasquale also. And it is. See, ding, ding, ding. High school. Great. Very good. You you were here, so you didn't have like a mascot or anything. Oh, uh, okay, no, wait. Uleria answer, <laughs> answered or <our> down. <laughs> Is Ulelia because I used the iPad of my son. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong. Ulelia. I think it's Ulelia. 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 It's yeah. such a nice sound. It is a nice name. Um, let's see. I see D Elementary. Mm -hmm. Any other guesses? D Elementary by Ulelia. Okay. Let's find out. Wait. Ooh, let me hide it. Mm -hmm. That way we can see the answer. Elementary school. And so the last one, guys, this is easy. The last one is me without the hat, without anything. University. Great. So a question for you all. Which school was your favorite? For me, my favorite, and let's use complete sentences. Don't forget, complete yes, sentences. Exactly. Don't just throw middle school. No, my favorite was middle school. Yeah, or my favorite school was blah, blah, blah. Or my favorite was blah, blah, blah. I'm going to put this in the comments. Talk, talk. My favorite school was university, for sure. I had so much fun at university. Yeah. But American universities are very different, I think, from European universities. No, European universities are also quite fun. Don't look at me. I, <laughs> I, I'm not like the perfect uh, European uni um, university student because I also uh, have. I, I also start. I work. I started working since I started university. Basically, it was like a two like together. Oh yeah, with my English school and university, you had the same. Yeah, at the same yeah. time. So the drinking part, yeah, sure. The drinking part. <laughs> Larry said, my favorite was kindergarten and middle school. We can remove the. We don't and need that. middle school, exactly. And middle school. And Pasquale? My favorite school was high school. Okay. I can see, I can see that. Like, I can see, I understand. When I say I can see, um, it doesn't necessarily mean that I can literally see, but also that I understand. It's mm -hmm. the way we we speak as Americans. And Valeria corrected herself, taking out the, but you were right, was. My favorite was kindergarten and middle school. We used the singular. My favorites were. My favorites were, then yes. Yeah. Massimo said, my favorite was middle school. No A. Was middle school. Exactly. Um. My favorite mm -hmm. was university because I met different people. Different people. Because people is already the plural of person. So we don't mm -hmm. need peoples. And then uh, when uh, you, for example, I know Kendra because I know her sh since she started working with me. But for example, if I, <laughs> if, when I go out and I see a person, I say, oh, hi, nice to meet you. I meet the other person. Yeah. 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 So exactly. because I met different people. Rafael, my favorite school was middle school because there were, we're going to switch, very helpful teachers. Mm -hmm. Very help. We have to put those adjectives before our noun. So very helpful teachers. Put it in the comments. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> I don't remember my kindergarten. It's been such a long time. Or too long. It's been too mm -hmm. long. 
Yeah, yeah also, it's been too long. Mm -hmm. And she corrected herself? Yeah, because I met different people. Good. Frank, even for me, the favorite, my favorite school was middle school. So again, guys, we don't need the article the for high school, middle school. We can just say middle school, high school. Yes, yes, indeed. Yeah. What was yours? Oh, no, you already said university. University. Was that yours also? You said university. I would say both university and high school. I miss high school. I had this philosophy and history teacher. She mm -hmm. was crazy, but I loved her. I loved her so much. Whenever we had a, we always had a test. Like she would always be like, prepare yourselves because I could ask you questions tomorrow. So we yeah. had to study every day. And when she did try to like test us, she would call us to her desk and line us up like little soldiers and say, okay, what did Heidegger say? I'm like, I don't, oh my God, I forgot to study him. Oh, I love her. <laughs> I liked her. Okay, that's scary, I don't like that. Uh, Marcello, my favorite school was university. Wonderful, great, you guys. A lot of people love university, even though the yeah. stress <laughs> isn't yeah. what I love. No, I, I loved university. I, I liked it more than high school. Yeah. You have no idea how much I've cried for university. Oh, I definitely had diets where I cried. Yeah. The stress was a lot more, but I think the, um, the friends I made, the, the activities for students, all of the sports games. Oh, yeah. No, we don't have that kind of the university thing that's going yeah. on. There. United States universities are fun. And expensive. But and expensive, yeah. Skendrin Sahar, you are very helpful teachers. Thank you, Rafael. Oh, thank you. We try. So, do you want to read this slide, Sahar? Oh, it changed. I, I because it's the same exercise. I didn't even realize. Match the subjects to the pictures: math, science, history, geography, art, and music. Okay, you guys, you know what to do. Exactly. They already on they it. They already on it. Yep. But try to start with the letters rather with than a. with the words. <laughs> yeah, start with A, guys. Which one is A? Oh, Massimo has them all. That was already. So yeah, it was just like yeah. yo. I'm on it. We're waiting. Which one is A? What about? I'll kind of hover it. What about A, guys? So A, letter A is. Tell me if people are answering. Art. Yeah, guess there we go. Awesome. A is art. That's my subject. Wait, we're not trusting Massimo. Where did he say? Yeah, he said also Massimo. Said, yeah, he said them all. <laughs> what what about? Me? Oh, it's your mm -hmm. favorite subject. My other favorite subject, <laughs> which is math. I see some people had guessed that one too. Rafaele guessed math. Massimo guessed at math. Pasquale guessed math. Good job. What about C? Oh, my favorite. Sahara's favorite. Yeah, I, I think like just like, guys, be careful because I could start talking about history in yeah. no time. Be careful. Yeah, don't get Sahara started. History. Good. It's a never, it's a never ending story. Yeah. Oh, is. this one I hated. I didn't like this subject so much. Um, like I like science, but this specifically is chemistry, and I hated chemistry. I chemistry I was okay with. Yeah, because um, we were also good at math. I liked the balancing. Yeah. I no, I couldn't. I couldn't understand it. You have no idea how much I was like studying this, but I was like, okay, as soon as I tried understanding, I couldn't solve the problem. I couldn't balance them. <laughs> Once, yeah, balancing I liked, but otherwise science wasn't my, my favorite subject. Um, which one did I guess? We're at geography. No, which... E is music. Yeah, we had some different guesses. Here, hold on. Someone else said E, music. 
There we go. Not geography. Whoop, not that one. This one. Music. Mm. Music. Music. There we go. Music. Dun, dun. <laughs> Music. Massimo, that's like, wow. Hurtful. <laughs> it's modern art or broken paint then? I think it's like close. Like it's taking a picture very close. Isn't it like abstract? Mm -hmm. Yeah, abstract art. And abstract. the last one is also my favorite. The geography. Yeah. Good job, yeah. you guys. Because, like, how can you understand history without knowing geography? True. I'm not very good at geography, though. It's okay. I can teach you. I'm much better at art and math. Those are my... Also, a little bit of history, but not... I like art history more. Yeah, yeah. There are also different types of history. That's the beauty of history. It's so, so bright, so, so wide. The questions. So yeah, the questions. What was your favorite subject? What was your least favorite subject? And who was your favorite teacher? Very good. Yeah. You, so yes. remember, your favorite is like at the top, but your least favorite is like at the bottom. The In class hell. you hated. Yeah, I did not. I hated English literature. That always <laughs> was a class that I did not like. I hated I, German literature. I never had to do that. I hated it. Oh my, I hated the teacher. So that's the problem. Hope she never finds out. <laughs> well, every year I had a different teacher. So, but I always struggled with English literature. I don't know why. That was always my worst grade. Because like you study Shakespeare and- It was also a lot of modern, people. not- I don't, Shakespeare wasn't until I was in high school. Oh, okay. And what else did you study? Um, God, I don't even remember. There's a lot of like famous books that we read. How to Kill a I, Bird. I don't think I read that one. Oh, okay. I'm I trying would, to remember. I would. The ones no, but Italian literature, it's amazing. We start with uh, Dante Alighieri in mm -hmm. Inferno, and then we go up to heaven. And just Italian authors are, in my opinion, amazing. There's, there's one specifically that I now kind of feel like we are connected in some way, and it's Giacomo Leopardi. Do you know him? Nope. Oh, he was this author who, since birth, had like problems, physical problems. He was like, okay. he had a hunchback. Um, he had problems with his sight because he kept on writing and he only had candles. So basically he always stayed home. <laughs> and just wrote. <laughs> yeah. Look at, look, Sahar, we have like already a bunch of answers. Oh my God, he basically unites us, Pasquale. Yeah. My favorite subjects, in this case there are two subjects, where history and math. Mm -hmm. Oh God, we are ready. Oh, we have to go, go. We have to go soon, yeah. Raffaele said my favorite subject was English language because I liked to know another language or I liked to learn another exactly. language. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. Good. <laughs> really favorite were art and geography. I don't know how he did that, but he also united us again. Again. <laughs> Uh, so art was my favorite subject, but ooh, my philosophy teacher was my favorite. My philosophy teacher. Philosophy. Yeah, I have philosophy. to agree with Valeria, also my philosophy teacher. I loved her. I miss her so much. My favorite subject was science and my least favorite was history. You're going to make Sahara unhappy. <laughs> Mine definitely was art and math and my <laughs> least English. We would just say English. Um, and my favorite teacher, gosh, it depends from what, if it, it was elementary, middle school, or high school. Also university. Um, different ones. Oh, we have more. Okay. 
my least favorite subject was history because it, don't forget your subject, Raffaele, it was boring. You're getting hurtful. Yep. <laughs> Here. <it's hard. laughs> my favorite subject was Leonidas of Sparta, Leonidas of Sparta War. Did you like the movie 300? 300. <laughs> Maybe. In Luke. Read a couple more of these and then we're gonna have to say oh, goodbye. Have to go now. My favorite teacher was a science teacher, science one, because she or he was very was fun. fun. Good. Oh, I think we have to go. We do have hour. to go. Thank you guys for all your comments and for participating. Thank and you. keep practicing your English and we'll see I you guys. Like history. It's nice. <laughs> Sorry, still history. Okay. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Bye, guys. Bye-bye. Bye, guys. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye.